Dr. Freeman. I realize that this moment may not be the most convenient for a heart to heart. But I had to wait until your friends were otherwise occupied, hmm? There was a time they cared nothing for Ms. Vance when their only experience of humanity was a crowbar coming at them down a steel corridor. When I plucked her from Black Mesa, I, I acted in the face of objections that she was a mere child and of no particular use to anyone. I have learned to ignore such naysayers when quelling them was out of the question. Still, I am not one to squander my investments, and I remain confident she was worth far more than initial appraisal. That's why I must now extract from you some small repayment owed for your continued survival. <sighs> See her safely to the white forest, Dr. Freeman. I wish I could do more than keep an eye on you, but I have agreed to abide by certain restrictions. Well, now, listen carefully, my dear. When you see your father, relay these words. Prepare for unforeseen consequences.